I'm Joel and this is my wife Charlotte. Hello. We have been married for eight years. We got married on Valentine's Day of 2010 and we practice NFP. One way that NFP helps you grow together as a couple is in intimacy and also you learn to respect your, your spouse in, in a way that I never thought was possible. Growing in respect for her and for women in general, knowing and understanding how amazing the female body is. And I think... And you get e closer together that way. Absolutely. And I, I think even though you are challenged in some ways to to be, you know, to abstain, it, it also helps you grow in self-mastery and, and be creative in ways that you show each other affection. And I think that helps you grow in intimacy and respect for one another. Yeah. And, you know, tough stuff makes us happy tough stuff makes us feel like we're living right tough stuff makes us feel like we're super capable of like overcoming and and nfps it's not the toughest thing that you're ever going to do but it's certainly tough in moments right it's, it would be easier to just be able to take a pill and treat your body differently and do whatever you want and nfp says no we i respect you more and i love you more that i want to be able to to really take take you exactly as you are and to give myself to you every time I can in our married life. And when we're being generous is when we're also happiest. And so that's why NFP has been so beneficial to our relationship because it's the struggle and the generosity that helps you actually grow closer together as a couple. Right. Whether it's training for a marathon or anything worthwhile is going to be difficult but we have this amazing resiliency in 2018 to eat healthy, to go green, to you know spend hundreds of dollars at the grocery store on organic food, and this is in line with that. You know, it's the healthiest thing for your body. We figure out ways to overcome you know gluten allergies and celiac disease, and we are incredibly resilient. Resilient. And I think this is another way that you can respect your body and also respect your partner in a very loving way. Yeah, and you do all those things. You know, you abstain from meat. You you don't, you know, have gluten, all this stuff. It's because it's to make your body feel, it's to make you feel better because that's what makes you feel best. Like. We would argue that that's what NFP is, what makes you feel best, what makes us feel best is to be able to abstain from this one thing sometimes to get the greater good for the other times. And you grow closer to your spouse in, in doing that. We have actually become so passionate about NFP and just how NFP has been so beneficial in our relationship that we've actually started giving talks um, about nfp to engage couples and that has been huge that has been so helpful it's been so awesome to be in the trenches knowing what engaged people are thinking about natural family planning and sort of trying to overcome those those misconceptions um about about nfp because i think a misconception is it's complicated uh it's it can be complicated you know in that there's tough days and days that you can't do things and you have to you have the call to abstain but when you have each other and you have a good really good well-formed relationship it's okay you can get through it another misconception is you never have sex that's not true um the method that we use is the symptom method i'm mean, sorry the thermal method which is basically i take my temperature every morning and it's red yellow green on my little contraption called the lady comp and you can find that online, but also it says red. Red is no, yellow is choose your own adventure. We joke around and green means go. So your temperature as a woman can jump like four tenths of a degree, whether you're fertile or infertile that day. So it's really important to take your temperature when your body's at rest. So we do that too. But I think a lot of people think, oh, you'll, you never get to have sex if you do NFP. And that's not true at all. When you have really accurate, amazing thermometers and really accurate, uh, fertility monitors of different kinds like there are more days than you think that you're actually able to to have sex for many couples who can't achieve pregnancy immediately natural family planning is amazing in in helping them do that and 
Many people use it to postpone pregnancy, time their pregnancies, and all of that is great. NFP and is a really wonderful way that you and your spouse can connect and really give 100% of each other every time you can in your relationship. Thank you for listening in to today's vlog on You, Me, and NFP, today's resource for natural family planning. Please subscribe and share. Together, you and me can share NFP.